we are asked to simplify the given trig expression. Let's begin by converting everything to sines and cosines, where cotangent x is equal to cosine x divided by sine x, and cotangent squared x is equal to cosine squared x divided by sine squared x. So the numerator stays the same, sine x plus cosine x. And then for the denominator, converting to sines and cosines gives us cosine x divided by sine x plus cosine squared x divided by sine squared x. And now let's determine this sum. Notice how the least common denominator is going to be sine squared x, and therefore we need to multiply the numerator and denominator of cosine x over sine x by sine x. This will give us the common denominator of sine squared x. And now determining the sum, the common denominator is sine squared x, and now the numerator is cosine x times sine x plus cosine squared x. But now notice in the numerator, we do have a common factor of cosine x. Let's factor out the common factor of cosine x from this sum. If we factor cosine x from this sum, we're left with sine x plus cosine x. Now because this fraction bar represents division, and dividing by a fraction is equivalent to multiplying by the reciprocal of the fraction, let's write this quotient as a product. We would have the numerator of sine x plus cosine x, which as a fraction has a denominator of one, and then times the reciprocal of the fraction in the denominator, which is sine squared x over cosine x times the quantity sine x plus cosine x. And now before multiplying, let's simplify out the common factors between the numerators and denominators. Notice we have a common factor of sine x plus cosine x here and here and therefore these factors simplify to one, and therefore the product is sine squared x divided by cosine x. But to simplify this further, let's rewrite this as sine x divided by cosine x times sine x. Writing this fraction as a product we should be able to recognize that sine x divided by cosine x is equal to tangent x, and therefore we can simplify this to tangent x times sine x. So the given expression simplifies to tangent x times sine x. I hope you found this helpful.